I want to. New game. Ooh, should we do a quiz? That's how we started our last rags to riches. Let's do it. Easy question. What age am I? Young adult. The best part of having an opinion is getting paid to have it, convincing others to share it, or telling everyone about it. Yo! <laughs> such a funny question all of those are pretty bad i can't lie i mean i guess convincing others to share it i suppose is the best answer but not convincing more so like spreading awareness and hoping that they would share it from based on the knowledge you share um i suppose that's more telling everyone about it but i don't know this question <laughs> that's so funny should we go getting paid for getting paid to have it <laughs> yeah we're gonna do a new save i'm gonna play rags to riches fully rags to riches i'm really excited um i kind of wanted to do this for a little while should we do short lifespan as well that could be fun because then it keeps us like keeps things snappy you know that is what we wanted to do previously can i do that from here short lifespan let's go fuck it let's do it Woo! toddlers or infants or whatever they are they're probably only gonna be an infant for like a day okay i'm new question <laughs> someone ate the last slice of my pizza oh I can solve this mystery. I'll treat everyone as a suspect. I'm better off without it. Yo, I'm treating everyone as a suspect. <laughs> I'm paranoid. That's probably gonna give me the paranoid trait, right? What is my greatest creation? Mixing all soda flavors into one. I once glued down some macaroni. What isn't my greatest cre creation? <laughs> um, I mean, what the fuck are these questions? Ia, I say Ia well weird. How do y'all pronounce the word Ia? <laughs> Sorry sidetracked ear 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 here here either or neither nor <laughs> i'm having a crisis chat how do i <laughs> i feel like sometimes ear that's how a valley girl would say it my ear ear like here or oh, here Ear like here. Ear. I eat it, I put it away, I leave it alone. I'm leaving that sandwich, that ain't mine. As a child, I wanted to work in outer space for myself on robots. None. None of those. The air quality in the neighborhood. No, I don't care about air quality. I mean, I do. I do, but not about my sim. Guests are coming over. How do I prepare? Clean and fix everything. Cook, cook lots of food. Cock? <laughs> Oh no! Oh no! Okay, let's go for cock lots of food because it's gotta be. What's for dinner? Veggies, a free course meal. Who cares? I'm eating it alone. It's really sad. I'm getting a new question. All of these are about food. Um, no. A friend trips and falls in my home. What's my reaction? Point and laugh. Are we an asshole? I'll provide first aid. Oh, that gave us a trait. Uh-oh. I have a great idea for a prank. If someone else is... It... Oh, no, I don't want to be prankster. What defines success? Having many friends, being rich, or bettering the world? It's being rich, obviously. <laughs> I feel like bettering the world. Because if you're bettering the world, you're probably also going to have some great friends, right? And having many friends isn't like the important thing. It's having true friends so i'm gonna say better in the world because i feel like that comes with having some true friends right what's the most important thing to me my stuff my family my reputation my friends my friends does that count as family yeah these questions there's not enough like nuance here the sims is lacking nuance here when i'm around children i feel angry they never shut up <laughs> Yeah. Friends of fa found family. Very true. Meditation is an excellent way to relax. Best done in a sauna. I'm too caffeinated. Let's do a great way to relax. Animals are far better than humans. A stellar companion. Difficult to care for. Oh, there's some really great humans out there. I'm lucky enough to know quite a few great, great humans. But animals are better than most humans. <laughs> this is hard. Animals for me, yeah. Okay, we're going for that. <laughs> cross stitch can be used for everything. <laughs> oh no, I'm getting a cross stitch one now, I think. I wonder what our traits are gonna be. I see plants and animals that could use some tender loving care. What do I do? Immediately jump in to help. The song I like just came on the radio. Crank it up. Ooh, what do we get? Okay. Uh. Okay. Wait. 
hi nice to meet you feel free to assign my gender adjust my appearance and select my clothing and don't forget to give me a name what are we a country oh let me hide myself um mm. country caretaker we are we w want to tend to the countryside and befriend all the animals and critters yo that's kind of me though okay and we also want to collect things we also love music we are good and creative that's pretty wholesome the wellness skill and the gardening skill we're in the culinary career we're gonna quit that because we're doing rags to riches although i think rags to riches technically you can um have a job and starting funds high oh baby girl that is not happening we're removing all of your money <laughs> all of it is going we're gonna start with zero so that's fun oh <gasps> That hair is real cute. I like that hair. What shall we name them? <laughs> Starting funds high. I don't think this game understands the assignment. I don't think so either. Let's do Carl. The surname can be Carl because we have history with that name. What should their actual name be? Violet. Violet's cute. Bambi. Stella. Jill. We need to give some rags to riches outfits um so not a dress we're gonna be starting way more humble than that something like this maybe what would y'all do if i dressed her in batu stuff that is so fucking cute are you joking i've never seen that before but what is that weird bit there is that a pocket <gasps> wow i haven't seen that outfit before oh <gasps> that's so cute why have i not seen any of the hello this is so cute this is really cute what the fuck wait this could work because it's like been patched so it's like she had this cute little dress but she's had to like fix it herself i also feel like the hair color is cool but i don't think she'd have been able to dye her hair whilst being not having a house <gasps> florence florence is a really pretty name because then you call her Flo for short flora flora carl yeah because she is really into the flowers that's a nice name. Ooh, the short hair looks cute. I like that hair. It's kind of practical as well, because you would want your hair back if you were like taken to taken to the streets and rags to rich in it. What about this hair? That's cute. That's real cute, actually. Um, right, I want to get rid of the makeups. What do we think? I think a dress would be really impractical, honestly. But it would be comfy. I do think realistically, dungarees would probably be one of the best ideas. <gasps> Wait, that's so cute. They're so cute. Hmm. I could spend ages on this. I don't know, chat. Oh, yo, that's badass. Oh, that looks so cool. Still got to do all her other outfits after this. <laughs> What's her backstory? How did she end up in this situation? That's what we need to establish. I like green on her. Yo, look at the flares. They're kind of fucking badass i can't lie yo she's fucking cool i really want to go for them that outfit's cute as fuck i kind of like these trousers too this does clip though which is sad she's so freaking pretty right your sweater everything clips no is there anything that won't dang that's real short though that's fucking cute <gasps> wait a minute wait i know it's not like practical but that's really cute oh chat i think it might be this I think this has to be the outfit. I know it's not practical, like, in the slightest, but does it matter? I don't think it matters. She cute as fuck, though. I love her. I literally love her. Flora Coral. I can't say her surname. <laughs> I don't think she's really gonna have anything for formal, to be honest. Um, I don't know. Are we gonna see formal? I feel like we might. I kind of want to spend, like, send her on some dates and stuff. I feel like that would be cute. It's gonna take me a year to design this character. This is cute. It's not that formal, though. It's quite casual, actually. Hmm, <laughs> like, formal is, like, wedding attire, right? Because then she also has party. Or is it, like, date? This is cute. This is a cute, like, first date outfit outfit it looks kind of subtle like she just threw it on <laughs> purple oh i don't know i can't choose she suits everything i do really like green on her though i think the the off-white is pretty they look fancy <gasps> i've never seen these items before how have i missed like so much oh my god iridescent yo she's having those maybe she kept like one fancy pair of earrings she's like i ain't i'm not parting with those they're too cute <laughs> uh sportwear i don't see her really using it much although she does have the wellness skill so maybe she could be a yoga girly maybe that's how she like remained calm whilst living with her wild family she was like i'm finding my inner peace i will have tranquility um do you know what this would have been a cute outfit as well Maybe for her cold weather. Oh my god, there's so many, there's so many categories. 
I don't know what gives yoga vibes. Maybe a sports bra or like this is fine. No, I don't like any of these swatches. <laughs> it literally doesn't matter. We're probably gonna see her in this like twice. I'll just do a sweater. Unless it's a good full body. No, we already looked at those. Is she gonna live in Henford? Maybe? Would y'all like her to live there? Where should we choose? Because if we're doing like rags to riches, you're supposed to buy like a really big lot, right? And then not move from it. If we're doing like the full rags to riches vibes, I think that's the rules of the challenge. Personally, I'd love it. Okay, we can do we can do Henford. I haven't explored that world too, too much, to be fair. Okay, she needs something real snuggly for bed because she gonna be in a sleeping bag. <laughs> She suits pink, you know. I don't really like the color pink, so I never dress my Sims in it, but she does suit it. Um, maybe that with... Why is there jeans? Is that just because they're custom content? Should we make her sleep in jeans? <laughs> How many of you will unfollow if I make her sleep in jeans? I think this. That looks comfy as fuck. Yeah, pink looks really good on her. She definitely needs some slippers. Maybe these. They kind of match with the pink and white and red. Makes sense if she likes animals. Yeah, that's very true, actually. So maybe like, I don't know, what's a fancy world in The Sims? Her parents lived in like a big fancy manor house in The Sims and she ran off and fled. She's making it on her own. Um, right, party. I could see her being quite a party girly. So we got to find her something to express that. Tie-dye. <laughs> Tie-dye. Oh yeah, they could live in the Get Famous world. Good point. Um, she's not actually going to wear tie-dye. This is cute, kind of glittery and fun. I like this top. That came with the recent pack, right? Oh, I think that's where those earrings were from, the recent pack. That's probably why I haven't seen it before. Like, it's fun to struggle in this game. It really is. Once you, like, have a house and stuff, it gets, like, I don't know, less fun. The challenge is gone. Maybe yellow? She suits yellow. She suits every color. I don't know what I'm looking for here. <laughs> Like, none of the skirts ever look that good. They're all so low. Why make a top that this that is this cropped and then make all the trousers and skirts, like, not high enough? Why do they do that? Like, that's high enough. I really like that color, but it doesn't go with the yellow top. That's kind of cute. Maybe I'll go with that. She could wear some tights, perhaps. Should I do a poll on what world? What, which are the options? Should we go for either Del Sol Valley, like the rundown area, or the um, Henford on Bagley? She can't wear the tights with those shoes because the nails stick through. I don't think she needs tights, you know. Although these shoes do kind of weird things to her feet. That looks painful. But it would be kind of fun to like live off the land and stuff. Like we could even do, um, what's it called? Uh, off the grid for a while. Like maybe until she's earned like a certain amount of money, we could put as a rule, she can't use like anything, any electricity because you'd have to have money to get electricity, right? So if she was off the grid for a while, it would make sense. <gasps> oh, her cold weather is so cute. We're probably going to keep that. Live off the food in your fridge so you can only make meals with what you have. Oh, we could do that. Yeah. So we'd have to do like the farming and stuff, right? Um, Which actually makes things really hard. I can't lie. Should I change her hair for like formal and stuff? I don't know if I have any with a fringe. Wait. Holy shit. That's stunning. Oh shit. She's so hot. Yo, I think I'm going to go for that. I know she doesn't have a fringe there, but it looks like she could have curled it away. Oh. <gasps> I love her. I fucking love her. Oh, this is my problem. Whenever I make a really cute sim, I never want to play on short lifespan because then I'm like, they're gonna die. And I don't want them to die. I'm, I'm attached. <laughs> oh my God, that hair's so pretty, but it's not really the same hair texture that she has. God, she looks beautiful with that hair though. Oh my gosh, that hair's so stunning. That's by Clumsy Alien. Oh my God, she's so pretty with every fucking hair. Yeah, I was thinking to do short lifespan so it keeps it like snappy, you know? Should we go for the curly updo? The only thing is it's not like really the similar texture to her other hairdos. Hmm. I do like using the styled outfits every so often. Oh, but it gives her so much like makeup and stuff. I'll have to remove all that. Dang, the makeup is intense on that one. Why do they do such intense makeup for all these looks? <laughs> this one's pretty. That's nice. Maybe this. I'll add her eyelashes back. <gasps> Shrimps. Okay, this is her, her this is her cold weather outfit for sure. If you didn't watch the last time we attempted a rags to riches challenge, my sim died. It is actually on YouTube. Uh, my sim died in the first stream, I'm pretty sure. Maybe the first or second. Yeah, my sim died like fucking right away. It was so sad. I'm giving her welly boots. Oh my god, she's so stinking cute. I would marry her in a heartbeat. Okay, we've got all of our outfits. I love how her like every day is so similar in colors in colors to her cold weather. It's literally like she just put on 
put on an extra jumper and then embroidered some mushrooms into it. <laughs> okay, this is Flora. She's a cutie. We love her. Let's begin. Hopefully, this run doesn't go as bad as the previous one. <laughs> okay, Carl. Oh, did we decide where she's gonna live? I don't think we did. Should I do a quick poll? Where live? Oh, I'm gonna start in spring, I think because all the other seasons are scary. I'm giving you like a minute to decide, so be quick, vote in the poll if you fancy. Um, okay, we're gonna go for spring. I feel like Hemford on Bagley is definitely gonna win here. Yeah, Delsol Valley would be cool with the storyline, but I definitely feel like it makes more sense that she's literally fled the world <laughs> to get away from her family. Um, hmm. This is tricky. I feel like we should go here maybe because we need a big lot, right? Isn't that one of the things of uh, rags to riches? You have to buy like a big ass lot. So maybe this one, two old mill lane. It's empty, it's wild foxes and off the grid. So I feel like that works well. Otherwise we're gonna have to demolish these houses and that feels really sad because I know actual simmers made these houses. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna select this place. Unfurnished because I mean, there's like nothing there. <laughs> and then we're gonna set her money to zero and we shall begin wait is this unfurnished why are there rocks can i delete those why are there rocks that's funny i like that that's kind of cute okay let us set money to zero. Oh, do i need to put testing cheats on first testing cheats on money zero there we go uh we has no money so that's fun. I'm also going to turn off the eco stuff just because no. How is it able to live like this and not and not die? Because you can like forage and stuff. We can get money pretty quick. And like, obviously you got to wait for things to spawn in. But we can straight away start like foraging. Okay, I guess we could... Oh, we need to quit our job. That's first and foremost. Uh, how do we do that? Um, Business? Quit job. Here we go. I don't think I want her to work. I think like later on in the legacy, we might because I'm going to try and do this as a legacy challenge chat. So I'm going to try and have like 10 generations. <laughs> I don't know if it's going to happen, but we'll see because that means every gen has to have a baby before they're an elder um, and on short lifespan. That's actually kind of tricky, I feel, um, but I'm going to try come and dig this. So this is good. Things have already spawned in. So that's kind of nice. She's already got the gaming skill um like <laughs> so that's good this is so cute and quaint oh my gosh look at this i don't think it's interactable at all but it's pretty see we can like um, automatically start getting money from all these things um which is good we don't even have to go fishing right now but we could we can also sleep on the bench um for when she gets tired but she's actually fine right now <gasps> look at the little ducks <laughs> that's so cute can you feed them Oh, I wish that was an option to like feed the ducks or something. That would be real stinking cute. None of the food or the, what are they called? Crops are in season, which is annoying. Hi, let's talk to you. Hello, Simon Scott. Hello. These are cute. The little benches with the lanterns on. We could do a spot of fishing. Fish together. Wait, that would be wholesome. Come and fish with your new friend. And what things have she got already? This is a cute little fishing spot. Are you for real? pretty let's see oh we already have a frog we can keep that we have a treasure map how much does that sell for it cannot be sold wait it cannot be sold or deleted but we can look for like better items with it i think oh we have a welcome wagon shit mm. wait they cute though hello hello cecilia okay hi <laughs> maybe i should go do the welcome wagon otherwise they'll hate me where is she? She's like walking so slow. They're going to have left. Friendly introduction. Greet new neighbor. Oh, let's talk to you too. <gasps> Fruitcake. Um, pick up a slice. Have a serving of that. Yo, her neighbors are sweet. They actually seem nice. Thanks for coming. Let's um, um discuss world peace. Because, you know, that's a good thing to do. <laughs> see if they're on board with world peace. Support his facial hair. We love to see it um tell a funny story let's just make friends i actually want to have friends in this playthrough because i never do i never ever do oh i can still sell the earbuds for sure goodbye he doesn't like me he's very angry okay 
Rude. Why show up at my house? You're going to be... Oh, there's like all these different things now. People like certain different things, right? Oh, some people hate small talk and shit. That makes things so much harder. I hate that. I hate that so much. Deep thoughts. Um, Help out? I don't know. Why is he so angry at me? I wanted to try and calm him down. Let's compliment her appearance because she's a cutie. I love her hair. Um, but the thing is, we kind of need the welcome wagon to like finish up soon because we actually need money to be able to sleep tonight. How much is a sleeping bag? Let's see. Or a tent. A tent would be pretty nice. That's kind of luxury. I can't lie. <gasps> He's having relationship problems with his wife. Yo, is that law? Oh, well... If his wife wants to, um, you know, get rid of him and come be with me, which one is his wife? Because either I'll be happy to take off his hands. <laughs> the drama already, I swear. The drama chat. Where's the sleeping bag? I swear that's a new item. But I don't see it. Oh, <gasps> we can already afford it. Yo, which one is that for kids? Supports toddlers. Okay, so that's going to be too small for us. 220 we can just about afford it i think we should just go for it honestly because we need to sleep that's something that has to happen is that is that a pizza yo <laughs> where can i put this where would be a good spot like maybe hmm, i'll just put it like let's just honestly put it there that's fine <laughs> um i don't really like the pizza vibe oh <gasps> that one's so pretty yes that's for sure the one we're going for the little whale actually what yo they just gained love <laughs> she gained love with this one. Oh, the drama what's your name oh this is the wife both watsons okay oh i should get her to take a photo actually because that gets your friendship up take photo with can we do it with oh you can only do it with one person at a time i can then take photo of take photo of rami um ask her out in front of him should i do it she's so cute yo yo this is cute and wholesome oh i love them oh i like this one yo they're like besties already i love that for them can we do what filter oh the warm is cute it's like sepia vibes look at her okay okay girly pop oh she's kind of coy there oh looking schmexy she looks kind of mean why is she giving her that stank eye hello right i'm done with the welcome wagon i'm sorry babes i gotta go i gotta go <gasps> flock of wild birds let's go talk to them we would definitely make friends with the birds for sure talk about music where is there to go and scavenge i don't see much crops or anything yet which is a bit stinky a bit stinky bad because we has no money all we have in the whole wide world is a sleeping bag and <laughs> that's literally it literally i mean we could fish a little bit more but um she wasn't really achieving much with the fishing i think i might get her to fish wait isn't there a community garden yo come here harvest some stuff i guess you could water for first there isn't anything to harvest yet oh <gasps> my god she can take right no she has to plant them i guess we'll get her to plant them then but at least we can come and get food from here i love having a community garden nearby <gasps> there's a fox um give a gift we don't have anything to give i can watch the fox look how freaking pretty this place is i literally love it and there's raspberries here oh fox is so cute i literally love this community garden i love it um okay they've left that's good though we got some friends got some friends on the horizon um and we've got this little local fishing spot as well and there is also a bench for us to sleep in but we've got our sleeping bag already so we're actually sorted with that i might get her to fish later oh yeah and i wanted to set some like lot traits as well okay i would like great soil that's for sure what else should we do sunny aspect might be kind of nice because they'll feel happy a lot um and then i'll go for that one actually what would y'all choose for the final trait and then i also want to add the lot difficult the little is it simple living the lot trait that i should add 
I'm gonna try that one. That basically makes it so we can only cook with the ingredients that we have, which is horrible, honestly. <laughs> it's horrible, but we're gonna try it. Also, we could set tiny living for now, but that feels a bit cheaty, maybe. I don't know. Homey, where is that? Here it is. This is so cute. Who built this one, this community lot? Like, all the clutter is really cute. I love it. Oh! <gasps> They're fighting. What's that? Mysterious mushroom. Oh my gosh. Can I take it? Oh, you can only eat it. I can't like pick it up or anything. Yo, these foxes are fighting, chat. I don't like it. They make such horrible noises. Ugh, I hate the noise. But I kind of want to plant it instead. Oh, she, she needs a wee. No, you ate it, you little shit. Okay, she really does be needing a wee. Ooh, that's a bit tricky, actually. We don't have anything. There's even a kid's playground here. That's so cute. This world is really nice. Oh, wait, here's a toilet. Let's use the bathroom. Uh, maybe use the bathroom first and then go fishing. I don't think she's squeamish or anything, which is good, because otherwise she would struggle to use the public toilets, I think, because they're, like, dirty. Um, but I think she's okay. Let's hope she gets some money from fishing today, because I would like to buy us something to eat. Um, we do have the fruitcake, obviously, but that's gonna go bad soon, probably. Okay, she fishing. Fruitcake never expires? Like, even fruitcake you make yourself in-game? No way, how did I not know that? Oh, also, we could cook ourselves something, because there's a barbecue. Like, literally, this place you could just camp at forever. It's got all your amenities. Except, like, hy um, hygiene, I suppose, is the only thing. <gasps> we, we caught a perch, okay. We could even grill the perch oh we can't grill anything because we need to have we need to have the fucking food don't we no that even counts off the grid like off where we are i hate that can you not just grill a fish why is that not a thing oh fish on a stick okay we can <laughs> we can make fish on a stick that's all we can make oh yo that's a big one that's a massive one. I'm gonna I'm get a screenshot. I'm gonna get a screenshot of that. Look at that big boy. Uh. Let's get a cute screenshot. <gasps> That's pretty with the little sunset in the background. That's cute. Dems to vibes. Day one of our little challenge. Why does she look like she's gonna kiss it? She kind of does. <laughs> she's just really proud. Have you ever been fishing IRL, Lil? No. Could you imagine me fishing? I would feel so bad if I caught anything. I would hate it. <laughs> Yo, some of these fish sell for a lot. Uh, the perch sells for seven. Minnow sells for six. So I'm going to sell the tuna for sure because that gives us quite a bit of money. Now we could cook the other two fish and have fish on a stick. That's me in the in the kitchen. I am chaotic. I think Dirk secretly hates when I'm cooking because, well, especially baking because I don't follow, follow any ing uh, instructions or recipes, I guess it's called. I don't follow nothing. I'm just like, nah, I'm, I'm winging it. I'm trying. I'm seeing what I come up with. Dirk is the absolute opposite. He follows things to a T and his things always turn out way better. <laughs> a gummy guppy. <gasps> Should we try and collect all the fish in the game? I don't think I've ever done that before. Too impatient to fish in real life. Does it take a long time? Bacon is a science. It's why Dirk's turns out better. Yeah. If you like winging it, cooking non-baking items would be more your style for sure. Yeah. And better chance of an accidental masterpiece, for sure. I 100% agree. Baking is so much of like a science, for sure. Like, it literally is like chemistry, isn't it? Because like baking powder, it's like does reactions to things. <laughs> I'm much better at just cooking. And usually like potato, no, sorry, potato dishes, yes. But tomato um, type dishes, I'm quite good at because I feel like they're quite forgiving. So like, I don't know, a chili or like a pasta sauce. You can kind of just put whatever seasoning in there and it turns out okay most of the time. <laughs> okay, let's cook ourselves some, a stick of fish. What is it? Fish on a stick. Come and grill yourself fish on a stick. We also got a lump of clay so she can like play with that. I might get her to keep that because they, they love lumps of clay in The Sims. Where did you get the frying pan from, babes? How did she have that? Oh, we level one cooking and it shows. 
Uh oh. Yo, that looks brutal. I can't lie, that is pretty dang brutal. Sorry, I didn't mean to be in this angle. Sorry, sorry, babes. I won't go above your top like that. <laughs> that looks brutal. Why is she stuck in like that? I hate it. Okay, well, at least hopefully it tastes good. And we do have a little bit of money. We have like 100 gold, which isn't the most. Why are you still here? Mm, let's just send her home. Why is she still hanging out? We do also have our fruitcake. I'm going to put that in our inventory for now. Um, and then I might just get her to head off to sleep. Wow, look at the sky. It looks so magical. And look at their house. They have a nice, a nice house over there, over the fields. And we have a sleeping bag. <laughs> so cozy. Actually, do you know what? There's worse things than sleeping in the middle of the countryside with just done some fishing, ate a nice little grilled fish for dinner. There's way worse things, I'm sure. Look at her. She's so happy. She's so happy. I love her. <laughs> okay, can we get more frogs? Do they respawn every single day? Oh, nay, let's dig for dig for treasure. Dig for treasure, babes. Um, yeah, do the frogs respawn every single day? Because that would be real handy. What's this little area? It's just fenced off. Kind of cute though. Um, I think they do. Look for frogs, because then we can breed our frogs. That'll be really good. Um, We can dig here again. Just do all the usual spots. Hit them up. Hit up the usual spots. And then I guess we can go and like take care of our plants that we planted yesterday. Ooh, oh, we can already harvest them. Verdant mushrooms. What the heck? And then we'll water everything else. A lot of things aren't in season, it seems, which is kind of annoying. <laughs> Maybe I chose a bad season. I feel like we need to do something more than just um, foraging here. What should we do? How can I make money? I guess I should save up for an easel or something. How do we want to make our money in this playthrough? How much is an easel? <laughs> That's the other thing. I don't think we have enough for it yet. Um easel yeah we need a lot more 350 dang dang we need a lot more do we just get to fish the whole day i can open this mysterious time capsule let's do that we also have a fossil rock i can extract the fossil <gasps> oh we got a fossilized udder <laughs> and a fossilized egg yo i kind of want to see how they look whoa Oh my god! I want to collect them all. <laughs> They're so cool, I don't want to sell them. Chat, do we have to sell them? They look so cool. I definitely don't want to sell them. If you have the new pack, you can travel to the recreation center in San Sequoia um, or make friends with someone who owns an easel and paint that. Okay, we could do that. Will we get to keep the paintings? <gasps> oh, we got these mushrooms. Let's come and plant one on our lot. Let's plant like two and then sell the others. They don't sell for the most money, but if we have a couple, we can get these planted and start on our little farm. Also, can I place the paintings? No, I need a wall for that. And we can breed our frogs as well. We've got a tiger frog and a surfer eggplant frog. So let's breed those. And we got a... <gasps> we got the sun surfer frog, a rare one for 125 gold. Okay, we're going to sell the cheapest one then, which was the 30 pound one. And I still need to open up this time capsule as well. She'll do that in a sec. Also, I, I'm confused about the science of how an udder could be fossilized. We don't question it. I think I want to keep those. It'll be cool to have them when we have a house and such. So I'm not going to sell them for now. I want her to be a little bit of a collector. I think she has to be that, right? Um, I think so. Or like she had like a special skill of that. Yeah, collector. She is a collector. I'll get her to use the bathroom after as well. Where is she? Is she running on her phone? Babe, you're going to trip. That's not very clever. Very reckless behavior. She's video gaming, I think. I mean, we can relate, I'm sure. Sequoia, thank you. This map is one of your favorites. It's so pretty, right? Rami's calling me. Hey, listen, we need a place to stay for a little while. You can accommodate us, right? <laughs> we have one sleeping bag. <laughs> we have one sleeping bag. I promise. Okay, we couldn't say no, so... Oh my God, they have a kid? Are you for real? You just, you sent your kid to me. Look at my living accommodation. I mean, they have a cute little backpack, but uh, I don't think that's a good idea. Yo, are they separating? Ha has she not? 
y'all y'all said that there was like relationship drama with with the watsons have they separated and now they need to come crash with me i don't think this is a good idea <laughs> crashing you in your field literally they're gonna be sleeping on the floor because i can't buy another bed for them i have 136 simoleons to my name okay so we have new people come and stay with us that's not a great thing really um because we can't accommodate <laughs> right now um they kind of forced it upon us we didn't actually get the option to say no i think it's just their kid who's come to stay that's really odd they just like his mom rang up said that they need to come stay and just sent him so that's kind of peculiar but yeah um <laughs> we got a guest staying oh they're calling again what is happening with this lady hey flora i've been thinking about getting to know johnny zest better as a friend do you think the two of us should hang out she's having relationship issues she sent her kid to come live with me and now she's like hmm i'm gonna go get to know johnny zest <laughs> what is happening what if you accidentally starve the kid surely he'll just eat right i think he needs to go home for his own safety <laughs> he really does sure i vote yes Go, go get to know Johnny Zest, I suppose. I don't know. Right, I do want to go to San Sequoia. Let's go travel. I want to go and get an easel. Um, So we're going to travel alone. Actually, we could have bought our new friend. Let's do that. Travel with Simon. I like Simon. Oh, wait, they've all arrived now. Oh, my God. We've got three guests staying at our house. Chat, I don't want to go home. I do not want to go home. That's awful. Why do we have three guests? <laughs> Let's go to San Sequoia. Okay, where is the place? Celebration center, is this it? Recreation center, yes. Let's go here. Let's go visit. Maybe she might have just kicked the family out to get to know Johnny, potentially. Right, let's talk to him first and foremost. Hi, Simon. How you doing, babes? Flirt. Actually, we should probably ask if he's single. I think Simon could be a really good partner. And we've actually got to move fast because we aged up in 12 days. Wait, is this short? Is this short lifespan? Let me check. That seems kind of long. Short. Yeah, we are on short lifespan, apparently. Why is always joking about facial hair? I hate that. I hate that that's a feature. I want to ask if he's single. Um, Ask if single before we move on, move on in. <laughs> also, I should definitely eat some fruitcake from my pocket. Pocket fruitcake. Woo. Eat gourmet fruitcake. Does it really not go out of date? That's so cool. Simon is married. Oh, well, there goes our goal. Okay, well, he can be a really good friend then. We'll respect this. I want to be a respectful sim who isn't going to just destroy relationships because we did a lot of that in our 100 baby challenge and um, it didn't feel good. <laughs> it did not feel good. Let's go find an easel. Here we go. Yo, we could do woodworking and everything. Write a book. What would y'all fancy? What would y'all prefer? Because like painting is fun, but it's been done a lot, I feel. Um, it's usually like the go-to to go make money, I feel. Puzzles? Do you make money from puzzles? How do I even play puzzles? I feel like I stand more chance of making an actual legacy challenge if I do short lifespan. You don't get a lot of money from puzzles. I don't even know how I do a puzzle, to be honest with you. Paint game card oh puzzles we could do a puzzle together so we don't get a ton of money from this is the only problem but that's okay we don't need to make money super fast what's this goth boy yo look at the goth boy we can sell that for a hundred gold let's do it i want the monies and we can choose a puzzle Ooh, custom puzzle from reference let's do a 250 piece puzzle fantasy and guardian of the forest that sounds so cool could i get someone to help mischief steal a piece that is so mean so freaking mean share to simstagram that will get us some fame i'm puzzling that's cute oh on the road to fame to be fair though she wouldn't want that that kind of goes against everything she stands for she wouldn't want to be famous so oh we can breed the frog again let's do that and we got two of the cheaper ones unfortunately but we can sell people are coming to puzzle with us that's so wholesome we can talk to them whilst we puzzle um gossip and discuss interests <gasps> you're a cutie hello hello um who are you bernice bernice are you single are you single i really think that she would be cute with us she's got a little fishing hat um i really want to talk to this sim they look really cute hello friend okay you can carry on puzzling now resume guardian of the forest now you've met her bernice let's talk it out congratulate on your job congratulations bernice um i want to ask if you're single straight off the bat <laughs> straight off the bat are you single 
Oh, was you, are you married? Married to Ian? I'm heartbroken. I'm heartbroken, chat. I'm so sad. <laughs> Why is everyone we fancy married? This is the worst. <gasps> Look at our puzzle. It's looking real cute. Just some little puzzling friends. Hanging out, puzzling together. What, so y'all saying that we can sell this now? That is so cute though. Oh, I'm gonna have to frame it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I know we did this for money, but I'm framing it. I want it. It's mine. I frame... Wait, where's it gone? <gasps> now it sells for more, technically. I don't want to sell it though. I want to keep it. Puzzles didn't work because it was too cute and I wanted to keep it. So what if we try and do a painting? I think if we just do like one or two, we'll start with just a small one. We can sell it to get just a little bit of money maybe. And then with that money, we could buy some seeds and do more gardening at home. I think that would be a good idea. This is such freaking vibes. Are you joking? I love the vibes here. I would love to be here painting next to this big window. That's so cool. What is this place called? A recreation center? We need these IRL. <laughs> She's playing with her clay whilst painting right now. Are you joking? <laughs> the clay gets really annoying over time, I think. They like just won't put it down. They love it so much. Emotional support clay. It really is at this point. Okay, I'm also... Oh, she can have a bath? Yo, no way. I'm gonna get her to take a bubble bath while she's here. That would be really good. I think she can also cook here. You can literally live here. This is amazing. Can she cook anything? Oh, and she could cook normal things without having the ingredients. This is amazing. Yo, and does she have to pay? She does have to pay for them, but they're not like expensive. She's not actually that hungry right now though. So we're kind of okay. I feel like this is sort of cheating. <laughs> I can't lie. Oh, she finished her painting. Let's sell that. We only made 10 simoleons off of it, which isn't the best. Why is Judith here? Do we know this person? <gasps> oh, oh, <laughs> I've called to inform you that your great, great grand second once removed cousin's friend's grandpa has passed away and for some reason has left you a vast fortune specifically to you. Will you accept? Now I know that if I say under what conditions I get like 2000 simoleons. Should I do it? Technically, it's not cheating. It's in-game. It's like an in-game built-in thing. So it ain't cheating per se. Yes, do it. We can build a wall. Like we can build a wall and maybe get a fridge if we do this. Let's do it. <laughs> 2,500 simoleons. Let's go. We ain't selling that painting now. We can just pocket the painting and go home. I did the money, 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 and it wasn't even more than under what conditions. How much was it? How much do you get if you do that one? Um, the conditions and you need to get married within a week. Yeah, but then you do get money. And if you don't get married in a week, what happens? You just not get any money. Yeah, I knew there was something to do with marriage with that thing, which is why I usually just say what under what conditions, because I know that one you definitely get money. And the other one I think you have to marry, which is annoying. But we have loads of money now, so we can go build ourselves at least one wall. Um, we're also having a freaking bath. <laughs> just a community bath right now which is great um and then we're gonna meet janae and then i think we'll head home after that because i do want to like build us a little a little space at home okay we have four people three we have four suitcases that cow plant suitcase is amazing i want that irl how are they gonna turn up with their entire family the audacity look at her <laughs> look at her she's like this bitch this bitch i love her so much she's such a cutie but she definitely hates these people <laughs> she's definitely like why the fuck have they showed up at my house uh, speaking of house we actually have some money to now make a little bit of a house so i'm gonna the side eye i know <laughs> so funny can we afford a box oh we actually can yo okay this definitely feels like cheating I'm gonna put my little bed in here. I'm gonna like add a door. Let's do a little cottagey door. <laughs> this is my little box. What do you think of it? I guess I could make this smaller actually. It's kind of big, honestly. I kind of want like a shower. Oh, oh, I need to put on move objects. Move objects on. I want a little shower, I think. Um, Right, I want to have, can I afford? A little work surface with a cooker. 
and then maybe also a fridge as well oh i didn't mean to do that oh why do we have these oh that's because we started with a career isn't it oh that feels a bit cheaty i'm not gonna use those i'm just gonna leave them in there because i feel like that's kind of cheating because that wasn't full rags to riches then you know let's do this here i should add a light at least i think we deserve a light <laughs> how expensive are those little hanging spotlights i hope they're fairly cheap they are 50. this space is actually pretty dang big we could probably make it smaller and then a fridge maybe yo we're living it up i can't lie oh let me put this like at the end of the bed instead i don't think we really need a toilet yet because we have one quite close to us but i suppose if we have the money we may as well i don't know this little box is our home i actually love it and we have money we're kind of rolling in it right now soggy bed mm, it's fine it's fine we don't mind a soggy bed let's get ourselves a little patch and then we can do some vegetables because we're actually going to need these to survive off of so vegetables and fruits and herbs um what gives cottagey vibes cottage vibes please i guess ever anything that came with cottage living this is definitely cottage vibes that's fine and we need to put a roof on as well i kind of want the roof to like extend over this as well so we can do like multiple seasons of plants i think that might be a solid idea um let's put a roof on this bad boy yeah like that because then it looks a little weird it looks a little funky i won't lie but it means that um in theory we should be able to grow any season plants under there i think which will be a great help <laughs> so it's okay it's okay that it looks bad because eventually we'll have a greenhouse we just can't afford that right now um i kind of want to do like some stepping stones as well that could look kind of cute no it doesn't look cute <laughs> it looked shit this looks so sad it's fine it's fine it is what it is what else do we need that's like all the necessities right i guess we could buy a toilet at this point may as well i'll put the toilet next to the fridge very nice and um hygienic little toilet can we afford a window because that would be like real fancy we actually can Ooh, what window should we go for do a little classic square window there and maybe one i don't know maybe above the bed that's cute vibes uh looks like my first apartment <laughs> Woo! and we also we can paint the walls really quick because we definitely have enough money for that and we also have her painting uh her painting to hang oh the pink is cute i might do some flooring too we have her painting to hang and also the photos she took of her friends so it's kind of cute kind of loves it you had a, a wall between the fridge and the loo but still basically same vibes you know but isn't it the cheapest shower let me see yeah we can't afford any other shower unless how much is that one if i sell this can i afford a better one i can i can get this one is it worth it for the for the more special shower fuck it let's do it let's do the nicer shower we got a cute little house and my game is lagging let's also hang up our little painting i think it should go over the stove so we can see it when we're cooking cute we also have our puzzle to hang up on the wall very cute i'm gonna need the light on <laughs> why why is there no light help oh we're off the grid you're so right <gasps> Does that mean we literally don't have light? Will they not work at all then? Or do I need to power them with a solar panel? Let's put these paintings around her bed. This is cute. She got all her friends, all her friends nearby. <laughs> they look so weird how I'm hanging them. These two are blurry, so I'm just going to delete those for monies. I'm going to hang them all over her bed. Cute. Cute. Should I just sell the light then? Or no, I'll do a solar panel. I'm going to save for a solar panel. Right, come along here and open these seed packets firstly. And is that family just going to like move into my house? I really hope they don't. Very cute little home. Think oh, the windows are on different heights. <laughs> is that going to bother anyone? My window is on different heights. Oh, we got some good stuff. We got bell peppers. Are any of these spring? That's summer. That's winter. That's fall. Summer summer and spring oh my god the only thing we can plant is parsley i want to cry actually can we plant anything if it's under the cover let's try it let me sell these we only need like two plants of each i feel that should be enough um let's do the bell pepper under here how many should i plant just one maybe and then we could do a grape under there and spinach because we actually need these for food so it's not just about planting the profitable ones which is a little bit stressful 
Oh, the fridge as well. And the oven, do they work? You can use this off the grid. Um, I think this works because it's letting me cook a fruit salad because I have grapes. Um, so I think the fridge and the oven work. I hate off the grid. It's just going to be another challenge. It's fine. We can deal with it. We can succeed with it. Okay. I believe in us. Why can I not do a, a salad? What do I need for that? You need to have specifically tomato and lettuce. Oh my God. We literally can bake. We can cook nothing. All we can make is fruit salad. <laughs> That's wild. Let me put my fruit cake in the fridge. And I'll also put all of these in the fridge too. Oh, I should bring these over as well. Oh, we need a bin or a sink soon. Oh my God, there's so much. There's so much to do, chat. It's fine. We ain't stressed. At least we don't have a million babies. That's a positive, huh? Where can I put my fossil collection? <laughs> I love how I have like, I own nothing in the world, but I have the starts of a fossil collection. So we have our priorities all straight, don't you think? Look at our fossil collection. Is there a reason we aren't selling the fossils? I'm, I'm emotionally attached to them, is, is my honest truth. Okay, I'm emotionally attached to them. Look, it's a cow's, a fossilized cow's udder and a fossilized egg. And you want me to sell those? I can't. <laughs> I love them. They are now my children. Also, look at my puzzle. I love our little house, our little interior design. <laughs> can we breed another frog? We can. And we got two of the cheap ones again. Oh no, we got the rare one. Yo, okay, we can now sell the tiger frog. And now every time we beat these two together, we should get an expensive one. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Get out of my house. Why are you still here? How long are they staying for? Let's check. Oh my God, they're staying for a week. Chat, no. No. What do they do? Do they just like hang out in my house? Like, oh, the... The mother and child are falling out right now. So that's uh, awkward. <laughs> that's awkward. What should I do? I should have bought an easel. <laughs> I forgot to buy anything to make me money. <laughs> I spent all my money and then kind of forgot I needed to make money again. I'm not very good at this challenge. <laughs> Oopsies. You can end the visits early. Should we do it? I'll let y'all choose. Do you want me to end it early? Let's go fish. We can fish again. It's all good. We have endless money opportunity over here. So the next things I want to buy, an easel, because that's qu quite quick money, and a solar panel so we can have light. <laughs> Did they bring sleeping bags? They didn't. So they're going to be sharing my singular sleeping bag, I think. They just keep falling out. Like I keep seeing them have like the negative, <laughs> negative emotional thing. I think they hate each other. Look, <laughs> I think they hate each other, chat. The family have just come to argue at my house. <laughs> Look at them. <laughs> That's so embarrassing. Level three fishing. Let's go. We got a bass. Nice. <gasps> no way. We just caught a camera. How much does that sell for? 85. I think we're going to keep that because we can take photos and sell the photos. Oh, we caught a salmon. 43. Nice. I love fishing in this game. You get such cool stuff. Oh, it's raining. And it's also 2 a.m. We should, um... We should go inside. We should go and cook us. Get away from my plants. I do not like these people. Look at them. Look. I don't like them. You're overstaying your welcomes. Actually, you were never welcomed. Why have you put your luggage in my house? Take that away. Take it away. They've also put bowls on my counter. The actual audacity of this family. I swear. Right, I'm going to keep all my all my cheap fish. I'm going to keep in my fridge. So, so far, just the minnow. And I'm going to sell everything else. Sell all of these. Breed frog again. And then I'm going to buy a sink. Because we need it. Because we've got four people living in this house. And I need a sink to wash up. <laughs> Let's grab ourselves. I think we have this one. <gasps> Ooh. It's kind of intruding onto our bed. It's fine. Let's grab a sink cheapest little sink oh my god we have no money again i needed the easel right come and wash these up wait i have a sink now chat <laughs> this makes no sense i has a sink who's gonna tell the game who will tell the game that i have a sink chat game is broken i'm just gonna put this the, the plates outside why is that one stuck i can't even drag it it can't be deleted. Fuck that. <laughs> Go and make yourself. Do not cook in my house. I swear. 
swear to god come here and cook um your fruit salad they're just gonna eat all my fruit salad aren't they at least food is free that's kind of cool actually we don't have to spend any money on food what's he taking is he taking my he's taking my fruit cake I hate it here. Why am I not cooking? Can she not cook because of the off the grid thing? Your sink has been broken too. Wait, the sinks not work? No. Plumbing doesn't work off the grid. Can I upgrade it? I need to level two of handiness for this. And then I think it can work. We can't use a sink. Wait, which sinks work? No, and we got less money back for it as well. Which sinks work off the grid? Oh, functional off the grid. Okay, we can afford it. I could sell this counter and we can afford this one. Function off the grid. Oh, this one's also functional off the grid. Is it just those two? Should I filter? How do I know if it's functional off the grid? Okay, I'll just go for this one. This one's cheaper. Oh my God. I hate functional off the, I hate off the grid. Off the grid thing sucks. I hate it. None of these are cute swatches. I'll go for that one. It's fine. Come and cook, babes. It's 3 a.m. and she's running in the storm. Oh, there is an off the grid category. I couldn't see it. God, he's already put a plate there. I hate this family who's moved into my house for the next week. They're just standing in the rain. I don't think they sleep. I really think you having a child with this man could totally solve all your problems. Babes, are you good? Where? Where am I going? Hello? Excuse me, carry on. Who does she think she is? She thinks she... Oh, it's because of you kicking... You're not even part of the family who's come to stay. Who are you? Wait, you are? Oh my god, it's literally a family of four in my tiny little box house. Are you for real right now? And she just kicked me out of my house because she wants to have a shower. No, get the fuck out. Are you for real? They gotta go. They gotta go. Look, you're not even looking. Oh my god, no. Listen, ask to leave. Sorry, babes, it's over for us. Goodbye. They've returned home, have they? Get out. Get out. Stop taking photos of my plants, you creep. Get out my house. Thank you. Go and resume your salad. <laughs> this is way more than I bargained for. I did not want a family. I wanted a solo sim. Delete her. <laughs> Why is he still here? You, the rest of your family has left. Please leave, Thomas Watson. If that is even your real name. Ew, did she just... No fucking way. She just... She just picked in her ear and then put her hand in the fruit salad. No. Oh my god, no. Listen. We forgive her for all that she's been through the last few days. If she needs to eat, like, ear juice, go off, I guess. I don't know. I don't know about that. <laughs> okay, she's got her first little cooked meal. Actually, she's had her fish on a stick, too. She's doing all right, you know. She's doing all right. I'm going to get her to clean these up as well now that this is functional off the grid which is amazing when will all these things be ready i hope soon i hope soon take that floating bowl please grab the floating bowl i visibly grimaced at the sims behavior so valid honestly tis gross she has a roof she's doing great yeah i agree she's also got like a million friends look how many friends she has mm, okay oh <gasps> she's friends with the flock of wild birds no that's everything to me what's this what does that mean the puzzle thing i don't know okay why don't you sleep it's like 5 a.m you should sleep off the grid category i need to look into that let me see what options do we have off the grid oh <gasps> no a bunny has come what is that mound of dirt oh <gasps> no bunnies are gonna come and destroy what has happened to my game i don't know off the grid let me see is it here show all off the grid here we go okay so this is all the lighting that works off the grid it's mostly just candles we can do cross stitch oh that's kind of a nice idea what if we do some cross stitching and we could sell those we might as well sell this light we can't use it anyways outdoor activities there's lots of outdoor activities we can use the bath look at this rickety old bath ew you definitely get splinters up your butt that's not nice that's not nice that's interesting there's not much uh now there's a whole building yeah we got that thing that pop-up that told us about um your great something removed person le left your will and we got 2500 gold from that 
<laughs> so we sort of cheated a little bit. Um, but you know, it's okay. It's technically not illegal in the game rules because it's part of the game. So it's not illegal, right? Also, <laughs> Rami just called and said, Johnny Zest and I had a blast together. Thank you for your advice. I literally don't care about this woman anymore. She is annoying. Her whole freaking family. They took advantage of my kindness and moved in. <laughs> That's too much for me personally. Do not be doing that. Um, let's harvest all actually. Harvest all. And then we got to water things that need watering. It looks like these need watering, but apparently they don't. Um, I'm scared because it means that we're going to have bunnies in our house and like ruining our plants. Huh. They even left their suitcase behind. They did. She likes gardening. Yes. Can I sell this? What about that? Should I sell their luggage? It, it sells for zero. Couldn't even give us that, could they? Couldn't even give us that. At least they got rid of it. If it's in the game, it ain't cheating. Exactly. Let's take some photos um, because we can sell them. Let's do some little moody photos. Oh, there's a bunny there. Let's get this little photo of a tree and a bunny. That family has a whole ass man mansion as well. No way. And they came and st like stayed in our place and stole our food. They deserve the worst. Oh, maybe I should put a couple of these mushrooms and parsleys in the fridge as well. I'll put just a couple and then I'll sell the rest. I love that one of your friends is birds. What's wrong with that? That's realistic. That is like my real life. I'm just friends with the wildlife. Let's breed the frog again. These are the humble beginnings, honestly. Just doing what we can to get an easel right now. I want to go and talk to the birds. They're my friends. Let's go and like hang out with them. Talk about feathers. We can just talk to them for now. Socialize about travels. I'd love to hear about a bird's travels, you know? That's actually cool. Look at them. Oh, I love them so much. This is one of my favorite things that came with cottage living. And the fact that you can befriend bunnies as well. <laughs> so cute. Hello, birdies. It's such a miserable weather day today. <gasps> Wait, they didn't like us. No. Be friends with us. Gossip about chickens. Chickens are just... I like chickens. They're really cool. Oh my god, look at them. I love them. They want a gift. I don't have anything to gift them is the problem. Yikes. I don't have anything. I will talk about flock politics. Um, And then we need a wee. But we actually have a toilet now. So we're kind of living it up. We have our very own toilet that we can use. Um, I want to go dig up all these little spots that we have been doing um, to make more monies. Is there anything else? We can go and check in on that community garden as well and see if there's anything to harvest there. Let's see, let's see. <gasps> no way, is that garlic? Harvest garlic. Roses. Although she is sad because she's uncomfortably wet. <laughs> and sore from chores as well. Poor girly pop. She's trying. She's out here living her, her best life, I guess. <laughs> she's getting so much stuff right now. This is a good little foraging day. <gasps> we got another fossil. Wait, why didn't she harvest the stuff? Hello? Excuse me, Miss Ma'am. Come and harvest this garlic, please. This is mine. I want this garlic and the roses, please. She doesn't have the most weather-resistant outfit. Listen, it's cute, though. <laughs> you can't disagree. It's cute. <laughs> Ooh, we got an enormous tribolite and a fossilized sea monster. Chat, my fossil collection is growing. I'm so excited. I want to open up the time capsule, too. We can definitely use that to cook with. And roses sell for a lot. And they must be this season. So we can go plant these. This is a good, a good ass find. I can't lie. Let's go and plant our roses. And garlic, maybe. I'll do like two of each. And the rest I'll sell. <gasps> oh, we got little, little creatures. Poppy and Hopper. I think they're like the similar ones that we had, that we had with the goth boy. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Should I collect these? No, maybe I should sell them. I can't keep everything. We're trying to rags to riches here. I need monies too. Although it's going pretty well so far, I feel. Let's keep the garlic in the fridge. And then these I'm going to sell. Yay. To be fair, we would be struggling if we didn't get that big money payout. <laughs> you need a fence? Why? Will that stop the bunnies coming? But at least we're doing lots of gardening. This is going pretty well. I'm very proud of her. I'm going to get her to take some more photos because they sell for some money too. And then we actually have enough money to buy the easel. Unless we want to save for something else. What would y'all like her to make money off? I just feel like the easel is just so good for generation one of this. Because like, it's so easy. <laughs> Let's take a photo of their luggage left in the rain. 
that's a poignant photo is that their house over there probably okay that's a poignant point in time the family who came to stay <laughs> and ruined my day okay let's see also easel works off the grid too there's not many skills that do unless we could do cross stitch that could be a fun way to make money yeah let's try cross stitch because i haven't done that before so i need to buy the box i think do i need a chair to do this on probably if i move my toilet <laughs> hmm hmm how can i squeeze this in if i like <laughs> put this box down here and then i'm probably gonna have to buy like a couple of these hoops right can i reuse them i hope so and then if i grab a chair and we can sit in a little chair um honestly what chair will fit it can be any chair you don't make much oh you don't make much money out of cross stitch okay undo undo i didn't spend the money that wasn't me i i didn't do that <laughs> why do you not make much money out of it i really wish that i could have a nice light <laughs> i really wish there was nice lighting literally all of these are so minimal i hate it oh wait we could go for this <laughs> it's a bit fancy and it costs a lot of money i hate it how is oh they're like basically the same price oh my god i think we're gonna have to buy this <laughs> this is i think the worst part of off the grid is the lighting i hate it i hate it unless we generate our own lighting that's the only other option but if we use a solar panel we can generate our own lighting but we can't do that yet right i'm gonna go for an easel for now i think it's the best option um we're gonna put a little easel next to our toilet and we're gonna paint perfect right let's do a small classic painting look at our humble abode i'm so proud of us oh my god babes can you resume your painting that's cool though yo can i sell that yo i can sell it for 150 i'm selling it i'm selling it she made the eiffel tower out of clay this girly pop is creative i can't lie right let's put our fossils down <gasps> look at our new fossils chat i mean look you i could never sell them they're so cool if i get like repeats i'll sell the repeats okay that's the best i can do okay sell this oh that's actually not a bad idea because it's so dark in there if we bring this outside bring the easel out so that we can paint in the light <laughs> come and do a small painting oh she got some milk ew ew i'll put it back in the fridge so it doesn't spoil okay we're gonna sell this one and then i think it's about time we go to the pub i don't know how we've been this many days in the game and not gone to the pub we need to meet someone we need to like get moving on that that front really so we're gonna go off to the pub um we're not gonna bring anyone with us because so far no one's tickled our pickle really bernice did but bernice is married <laughs> Okay, off to the pub. I'm gonna try and meet a partner, a potential partner. <gasps> Ooh, it's happy hour for all the cheapskate sims. That is us. Okay, let's go and buy ourselves a drink, shall we? <gasps> oh, hi. Wait, oh my God, with the tattoos. Yo, wait, Sarah Scott. Oh, they're married. They're married to Simon. Oh, I thought I thought we could have a I thought we could have a chance. Let's buy ourselves a drink. We deserve it. Um, what should we go for? I'm thinking something kind of fun, but not really expensive. So, <laughs> what about a nice little Granite Falls Gapo Grappo Blanco? That sounds good. Get yourself a nice glass of wine. She's been working her butt off all day. Oh my God, we cannot escape her. <laughs> She's a fan. Wait, I'm not a celebrity, am I? I don't want to be a celebrity. Let's talk to you. Hello. Friendly introduction. Let's chat to the bartender. This is such cute vibes. <laughs> Something kind of fun but no expensive is also me at bars. Same. Oh, we can order some food. We're not really hungry yet, though. Let's just, like, tell her a joke. Who are you? Dirk. Dirk Dreamer. Dirk. He's a proper celebrity, isn't he? Dirky, you're in the game. This is totally an outfit Dirk would wear as well. Dirk. He's not giving the best vibes. Look at him. He's like, look at me, look at me. <laughs> this is exactly how Dirk acts in real life as well. <laughs> he goes to the bar and demands all the attention. This is Dirk. Giving for real Dirk vibes. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, she can go and light the fire maybe. Go and light this and go sit with your glass of wine by the fire. You always romance the grocery girl. Wait, what grocery girl? <gasps> oh! 
Wait, this person? <gasps> Kim Goldblum. She cute. Let's come haggle. <laughs> Let's meet her initially by haggling. There's so much to do here. Oh, there's also this. What is this? Garden shop items. I want to buy things. We don't have much money, but I want to buy. Okay, once she's lit the fire, she's going to come out to the grocery shop. Um, And then we'll come back. We'll come back here, I'm sure. We'll come and get food here maybe tonight. Um, We can have some dinner at the pub. That'd be cute. A nice little outing. Okay, she don't want she don't want me to haggle. Rude. Oh, she said yes. Yo, we're in. I'm gonna give her a respectful introduction now. I love her. I think I'm in love. You can also sell items for a 10% profit. Let's go. And also let's buy some items. Um, okay, we don't know what is available in which season is the only problem. Oh <gasps> no fucking way! dragon fruit is a thousand to buy that's so expensive fire milk what that's scary what should i buy they're all so expensive they're definitely marking up the prices a lot because parsley only sells for two although that is two of them i guess you recommend a carrot okay we can go for a carrot i might get an aubergine as well oh we need lettuce let's get a pumpkin a small mushroom and we'll get a carrot I'm just buying everything. I'll get a green bean. Mm, green beans are kind of expensive. How much is a carrot? 10. We can just about, we just about waggle that. Waggle? Wiggle. I don't know the words. <laughs> uh, maybe an onion. They're kind of expensive. Oh, pomegranates are 112. What? I feel like that's enough, right? That's good. We probably should buy some meat so we can actually cook some of the foods. Like how else do you end up cooking the meat foods? Because you can't make your own meat, right? And like, Can you kill your own chickens in this game? I don't think you can. So like, if you're doing the simple living trait, how do you get meat? Do you have to buy it? You can trade your chickens for meat. No. Meat sub substitute with mushrooms? That's cool. So you make them into a meat substitute. That's cool. Okay, I'm going to buy these groceries. And then we're going to talk to Kim. Um, Let's... Oh, we could help with errands. Flora discovered information about oversized pumpkin. Oh, okay. And oversized lettuce and oversized aubergine. <gasps> Wait. Oh my God, I remember these. Oh, chat, this is so cool. Should we do her an errand? I don't know if we have any of these things at the moment. It's lovely to see a new face around these parts. I'm just too busy right now to make a proper introduction of myself. If you have the time and mind to be a help, would you be a dear and grab some of those grocery orders? I've forgotten to eat again, not to mention that bouquet I was going to make for my friend. Reward, an assortment of eggs, flour. Ooh, should we do this? I need ingredients for my next meal. That will be hard. This is just like helping with the groceries, right? Let's try this one. Oh, I could do two. Let's do both of them. Okay, we need... Uh-oh. We need to deliver a cheese and a single serving of beef wellington to the grocery store owner. And we also need to collect four grocery orders... Deliver a single serving of food to the grocery owner and deliver a rose for the cr to the creature keeper. This is confusing and this feels like Stardew, so it's very cool, but also kind of confusing. What do I need to do? You're a lifesaver. I need to collect a few grocery orders. So just write down what Sims want and then let me know. And if you don't mind, I'm feeling a bit peckish and could use a bite to eat. Could you bring me any serving of food your choice? Surprise me. Oh, and here, let me give you a rose to take to the lovely creature keeper who stays in Bramblewood. I'm a bit nervous to deliver it myself. Would you mind bringing it to them and telling me how it went? Okay. Okay. We actually came here to find romance though. So let's also like talk to her i need to find out if she's single so let's ask are you single please be single their stool is so cute by the way i love it have you met the locals in henford on bankley it's a really close-knit community um we've met some of them and they're kind of assholes <laughs> so far all of the oh she's single chat do we go after kim what do we think we should head home and plant all these things in the ground and then get working on the grocery shop orders i guess they're kind of confusing though so i don't know how we're gonna do those um but we'll start oh <gasps> she's pregnant bernice oh my god i love bernice i'm so sad i really wanted to be with her <laughs> but um she's pregnant and married so i guess that ship has sailed that ship has sailed far far away from us <laughs> oh items removed 
Wait, what? What item was removed? I don't even have any mods. That's weird. Wait, we can't plant these. Can we? Chat. Everything I just bought can't be planted. Wait, this this can. Why can some of them not be planted? That's odd. Oh, it says plant. Chat. Drag this item into the world to run this interaction. Plant. Dragged it into the world. Can't plant. You need to plant it on a plot. Okay. Well, that's mighty annoying. I'm gonna have to buy a plot. Okay, we need to expand our roof. <laughs> huh how are we gonna do this i think if i bring this here i'm gonna change the roof a little bit and then i'm gonna get another roof no that looks horrible i don't know how to do this because i want to have like i want to extend it basically um but that will look like really bad i can put it under though just in case i'm kind of scared they won't grow <laughs> this looks so bad chat this looks so bad okay this is uh this is the vibe i guess it will work until we can afford a greenhouse you know and we'll grab is it any old plot can i just use these i think i think i can right so we've got two of those now i'm gonna move the easel i think i might plop the easel just like around the front here and then we've got we could probably fit three under here maybe and they hopefully are all functional because i feel like you can walk um over them right instead of like the garden pots where you can't i think you can walk over those hopefully that will work fingies crossed so now let's put our carrot there let's put our mushroom oh it didn't work you need to buy oh you can buy seeds for big crops and then click on the patch so i can't plant these in the patch do these just not go so i have to buy the big seeds is that it the best you can do is put them in the fridge no okay that's fine we'll buy some big pat uh big big crops then you had to buy them to learn how to do the big crops right so i guess it makes sense um purchase oversized crops um let's get ourselves we'll definitely get a lettuce i'd quite like to do a pumpkin they're very expensive let's do those plant oversized crop okay pumpkin seeds and then plant plant oversized crop lettuce seeds we did it okay that's pretty cool and now i can put all these things into the fridge so will you get oversized vegetables or will you get like normal size vegetables how does that work <laughs> yo it takes up like a whole thing okay oh my god <laughs> we're gonna have to have a lot of patches then if we want to have like a lot of food dang this is pretty intense it's cool though i've never done that aspect of the game so that's exciting. I might get her to do a little painting because we do need some more monies. Um, she's going to do a little painting. And I think that's where we'll wrap up for today. We got a lot done, you know? We got a whole little house going on right now. Even with that, with that disaster of a neighbor coming, trying to live in our house. <laughs>